Hello guys, welcome aboard Apex Math. My name is Bino. In this video, we are going to calculate the radius of the semicircle which is inscribed inside this triangle. And the first step is to introduce two radii with respect to the semicircle, each perpendicular to the sides of the triangle at the point of a tangency. We introduce a line segment from that vertex to the center of the semicircle, which will divide the original triangle into two parts. So we have the first part, which is shaded in green, and we calculate its area. And we call it area 1, which will be equal to half multiplied by base multiplied by height. Our area 1 will be equal to the half multiplied by the base which is equal to 14 and the height will be perpendicular to the base so our height will be equal to the radius of the semicircle denoted by the letter r and our area one will be equal to the half multiplied by the 14 which is equal to 7 multiplied by r from here, we calculate the area of the second triangle, which we shade with gray, and we call it area 2. So our area 2 will be equal to half multiplied by base multiplied by height. Our area 2 will be equal to the half multiplied by the base, which in this case will be equal to the 16. And our height perpendicular to the base will also be equal to the radius of the semicircle denoted by the letter R. Our area 2 will be equal to the half multiplied by the 16, which is equal to 8 multiplied by the r so the total area of the bigger original triangle will be equals to area 1 plus area 2 which will be equals to so our area 1 we determined to be equals to 7 r plus area 2 which we just determined to be equals to 8 r and 7R plus 8R will be equal to 15R. So the area of the bigger original triangle will be equal to 15 times the radius of the semicircle. We move on and calculate the area of this scaling triangle using Heron's formula, which states that the area of any triangle with side length ABC will be equal to the square root of S multiplied by S minus A multiplied by S minus B multiplied by S minus C and A, B and C are the side length of uh, this uh, triangle and our S is equal to the semi-perimeter of this uh, triangle. So our S will be equal to A plus a B plus a side length C divided by 2. And our S will be equal to our A. Our A is side length 18 plus our B, which is equal to the side length 16 plus our C, which is equal to the side length 14, divided by 2, and our S will be equal to 18 plus 16 plus 14, which is equal to 48, divided by 2, which is equal to 24. And we substitute, so our area of the triangle will be equal to the square root of s which we determined as equals to 24 
into s which is 24 minus a which is equal to 18 multiplied by s minus b so we have 24 minus 16 multiplied by s minus c which is equal to 24 minus 14 and the area of this triangle using Heron's formula will be equals to 48 multiplied by the square root of 5. So now we are going to equate these two areas. So let's copy and paste. So equating the two, we have 15 multiplied by the radius of the semicircle equals to 48 multiplied by the square root of 5. Our R will be equals to 48 multiplied by the square root of 5 divided by 15 and our r will be equal to 16 multiplied by the square root of 5 divided by 5. Finally our r can be expressed as 16 divided by the square root of 5 units thank you guys for watching if you have any questions you can drop them in the comment section below remember to subscribe like and share the channel if you find this content interesting